Stick around to the end and I'm going to tell you exactly why you should never walk to the other side of the barn. When my father was young, he was raised on a farm in the middle of Tennessee. At night, they would split up and play hide and seek in the dark. One hot summer night, when it was my father's turn to be seeker, after several minutes of not finding anyone, he decided to venture into the field and walk down the trail leading past a couple of hay barns. About this point that he noticed a sound coming from above. When he looked up at the barn, he noticed that there were fingers lapped over the ridge of the barn roof. My father hollered out, found you, come down, you're out of bounds. Not only did he not get a reply, he could hear the child sliding down the other side. Worried that someone was about to be seriously injured, he ran as fast as he could to the other side of the barn. He got to the other side of the barn, he noticed that there was no one on the roof and there was no one on the ground. Suddenly overcome with an intense feeling of dread, he turned and he ran as fast as he could back to the main house. When he ran out from behind the gate, he was met with all of the other children standing around waiting on him. He had been gone for only a few minutes, but the other children swore that he had been gone for over half an hour. And when he had not found anyone, they all became worried and climbed out of hiding. None of the children had been in the field.